Item duping in Risk of Rain 2 has been something I've always thought about and always wondered if there's a way to achieve it. It's always seemed like just out of reach, so far to the point where nobody's ever really talked about it, well, at least not that I've known of anyway, and it just seemed so far from reality that I kind of just accepted it. That is until now. Now, before I go into this too far, I will let you know that the parameters needed to achieve this dupe are very rare. And as far as we currently know, it only works on void items. Luckily for us, the void items in this game are some of the most broken items in existence, ranging from instantly killing enemies to literally taking no damage. So it is very rare, but extremely powerful still. So to achieve this dupe, you need to have a void item in your inventory. For this example, I'm using safe spaces, but just now it works with any void variant. Now, where the difficult bit comes in, and honestly, why I'm I'm super okay with abusing this any chance I can get is you now need to find a printer of the opposite variant to your void. So for example, I'll need to find a tougher times printer and find a scrapper right next to it. The scrapper doesn't need to be touching the printer, but needs to be close enough that you can turn and interact with them both very quickly. Now here's where it gets tricky. You need to print an item from the printer, pick it up and then immediately open the scrapper. You have approximately half a second to do this, but once the scrapper menu is open, there's no more time restriction. You can stay in that scrapper menu as long as you want. This will scrap the item you just printed into white scrap, but still count it as being corrupted and thus giving you another stack of the corrupted version. As you see here, I went from one safer spaces and one white scrap to two safer spaces and one white scrap. You have now officially duped an item in Risk of Rain 2. I am still gobsmacked at this works. <laughs> now, the reason this works is because the game doesn't immediately corrupt the item upon pickup. It actually stores the item in your inventory for about half a second and then corrupts it. But since the scrapper doesn't update in real time, all the scrapper sees when you open it is a white item that it can scrap, despite the fact that it's actually corrupted already in real time. Special note as well, this also works with elixirs. If you open a scrapper and scrap your elixirs as you take damage to push you past that 25% health threshold, your elixirs will break and give you a health bag, but you'll also get the white scrap from scrapping the elixirs. Now, I wouldn't recommend this one, but it definitely is a cheeky little way to get some extra health back and some scrap at the same time. In fact, this is actually a big part of how this got discovered. Another streamer called Wallywog did this exact thing with their elixir and that got people thinking and two people seemingly simultaneously came to the same conclusion. Friday Cub, another streamer and YouTuber, good friend of mine, and Yuke, a prominent member of the Risk of Rain community, both labbed it out and got to where we are currently. I will say a massive shout out to Roddy Cup for always labbing this stuff out. They always find a way to push this stuff to the limit. And they also plan to have a whole YouTube page dedicated to tech discoveries in Risk Rain 2. So make sure to go check them out as well. But let me know what you think. I personally feel like this is one of those tech discoveries that we can really push further. This is really just scratching the surface. There are so many incredibly smart people in this community that have broken this game wide open in the past. And I think this is just the beginning of this. And of course, if you like the video, then make sure to subscribe and let me know in the comments how far you think we can push this. I'm super keen to test this further and really push it to the limits. All right, thanks for watching. Subscribe now. Love you, bye. Mwah.